The GTA is being blasted by a winter storm. At times, the winds are gusting. It's frigid and icy out here. Driving conditions remain hazardous in many areas, and power outages are being reported right across southern Ontario. So here's a look at everything you need to know as these wintry conditions will continue into the holiday weekend. Please be safe out there. The best thing probably that you can do over the next uh, day or two or three um, is to stay home. That message from Toronto's mayor as this winter storm wallops the GTA and beyond. Plummeting temperatures this morning turned some wet roads and sidewalks into ice rinks. And then the snow started, making conditions out here extremely dangerous. The city says it's all hands on deck when it comes to salting and plowing, but with gusting winds whipping the snow around, it will take time. This is going to be a multi-day, multi-round event. If we do receive the anticipated accumulations of possibly 10 to 15 centimeters, we're looking at multiple rounds or multiple passes in order to make the roads safe and passable. Public transit is also heavily impacted. The TTC proactively shut down the Scarborough RT along with 41 bus routes in steep areas. Metrolink says GO buses will be experiencing major delays and train service has been reduced to ensure things run as smoothly as possible. We are running trains on one track in each direction. Much easier to clear one set of tracks. Uh, much easier if we don't have trains passing each other, relying on those switches and signals. Stretches of highways west of Toronto have been shut down due to treacherous conditions. The London area saw a major pileup involving at least 50 vehicles. All three border crossings in the Niagara area are also closed if you are heading to the U.S. And whiteout conditions are being reported on some GTA highways. Right now, we need every driver to realize how quickly those conditions can change. If you have to be on the roads, drive carefully, drive slowly, give yourself lots of distance behind the vehicle in front of you. As powerful winds move in, down trees and power lines are also a major concern. Tens of thousands of Hydro One customers right across southern Ontario are already in the dark. The utility says restoration could be delayed because crews will be hampered by the wintry conditions. We are urging our customers to prepare for a potential extended power outage. Now, we will continue tracking power outages and the impacts of this winter storm on our radio station, City News 680, and on our website, citynews.ca.